Welcome, welcome to the all new Preston Lopez Show. Happy New Year, happy 2015. Um, gracias por estar en sintonía. Yo soy Preston Lopez. Feliz Año Nuevo 2015. Wow, wow. Yo me recuerdo cuando dije eso en el 1997. Cuando come, primero comenzamos el programa del Preston Lopez Show. Ya tenemos 18, 19 años. Bueno, I'm going to see you later. Thank you for watching the show. Thank you for uh, watching the Preston Lopez Show. Happy New Year again, 2015. Um, I hope uh, you like the show. I hope you, you enjoy the show over the years. I was saying, um, I was saying before that, uh, you know, I want to thank the fans, the fans of the number one fans, friends, and that watch the show for all these years. A lot of people didn't haven't supported. Well, a lot of people haven't viewed the show since it began in 1997. I know a lot of people started watching the show like in 2004 around there, um, when all the you know, we, we put a lot of sexy stuff on. So a lot of people watching the show uh, from that. But before that, before 2004, the show, you know, we had a lot of a lot of good guests. We had we had little Kim. We had a, a Snoop Dogg, a Snoop Doggy Dogg. We had a cooking segment, and we we used to um, have a lot of rappers and celebrities, and, and a lot a lot of it was, it was a lot of good stuff, you know. But then we you know we changed the show in 2004, and at least until to like 2000, almost 10 years later, we were doing. Um, a lot of sexy work, a lot of sexy uh, stuff on the show, which is still incorporated, but it's a little bit more tamed. You know, it's a little toned down, tamed, a little tamed, a little, but it's still, it's still sexy. You know, you can see a lot of sexy, I mean, you won't see me without my shirt off, because or without my clothes on. You can see those videos up in the internet or whatever. Are they still there? Yeah, they're still there. Um, but, um, but you can see other people on the show. Um, and the reason it's been, a, a little toned down. It's not because of the of the stations, which the Eminem and BK they have supported this all segments and all facets of the show. Um, they they have supported the show, so they're good. Like all the TV stations, uh, except for Bronx, they were a little you know little assholes because they were like into like they were into like this. Well, they were into the religion and they didn't want to set my show, so you know what, my show is not there. But otherwise. B Cat and Eminem have been a champion for our, for my show. It's been like the number one show. Um, but and thanks uh, to them, and of course, as I said before, the fans they've been supporting the show. Um, it's been going up and down. You know, the show has always been, which I didn't really start it, but well, it did start like political. It started with that police brutality march in 1997. But throughout the years, it's been political and sexy, and that's a combination for being for the show being a little controversial. So you know. I want to thank all the uh, Rada Bahara, Watch the Heights, Umbo Lower Side, Chelsea, all the projects. That's what we used to start saying. All the people working in bodegas, restaurants, and, and clubs that I see. All the doctors, the nurses, the police officers, even the firemen that came up to me, and fathers and mothers. And I'm sorry, but little little kids come up to me and say, "Yeah, I watch your show." So you know, I want to thank all of them for watching the show through the years. I know they want to keep it on the hush hush sometimes because you know it's, it's a little it's a little out there. But they have supported the show, and they have supported me, you know. And that's what I want, you know, people to do. When, when you like something and you agree with something, support it. Like those people, the protesting, those people, which me, was, uh, I, I was in there too, protesting, and we pro, you know, when you protest, and even if you can't make it, and and you and you know, and, and you agree, if you agree with them, at least support them. I mean, like you know, at least post something on Facebook or like. You know, because everybody, we're at the end, we're doing it, and they're doing it for you, for your benefit. You might not think so, but in the long run, you know, be like, thank you, protesters, for doing this or for protesting. Not only police brutality or whatever injustice, but there's a lot of stuff that happens that if you're not in the office, if you're not, if you're not a politician, you're not there to change the law. So, you know, you have to protest. No protest, no change. You know what? I'm going to just keep on going and talking because I could talk for a lot of stuff. There was a lot of stuff that went on. I haven't been on the air, like, you know, to talk about stuff. But just be yourself. The show is always about being yourself and being true to yourself. I don't care what you do behind closed doors, but you know what I'm saying? Be yourself. Don't, don't, what I'm saying is that don't be fake with other people. It's hard sometimes to, to, uh, say it, you know, because a lot of people it's hard for them to change, but it's trying to be yourself. It's easy to do. We'll be right back.